I'm going to show you a great way you can organize some of your tabs in Google Chrome. So as you can see up here towards the top, I've got a bunch of tabs running, and I'm running a tech challenge. So I've got these one, two, three, four tabs right here that I kind of want to group together as a tech challenge. So if I were to just click on each one, and then I hold the control button down, and you can see I'm highlighting each one of these tabs right here, all four of those tabs just got highlighted. If I right click on one of those tabs and go down to where it says add tabs to a new group, it'll ask me what do I want to name this. I'm going to call it my tech challenge. And I can pick a color, so I'm going to think of red. And as I click off of this, all four of these now have this border around them. So then over here to the right, I also have my blog running. And maybe I want to record and keep these tabs organized in some way. So same thing, I'll control, click all three of them, right click on one of them, add tabs to a group, a new group. I'm going to call this Badner Bytes. And I'll just make that one green. So just from the looks of it right here, you can see the name of my grouping. And all the tabs have a color. But that takes up a lot of real estate up at the top. If I want to kind of just not deal with the tech challenge right now, if I click on the word tech challenge, it condenses all those tabs together. And the same thing with my Badner Bytes. So now I've got all of this space left that I could open new tabs. If I want to go back into my Badner Bytes and take a look at one of those pages, I can click on that group. It opens it up, and I can go from tab to tab. I can rearrange them if I want. I can even add other ones to it. So maybe I wanted to add Twitter to that for some reason. I can take that tab and just drag it into that group somewhere. And now you can see it's got that green outline. Same thing, if I click the name of the group, it condenses it back down. And once I'm all done with that group, so maybe I don't want it anymore, I can just right click on the name of the group and go right down to close group. Boom, all of those tabs now are closed and I don't have to deal with them anymore. So it's just another way to kind of organize your tabs. You could have your Monday tab, tab, your Tuesday tab. One way to organize some tabs for easy access and condensing.